previously on Draft House. Just grew up playing football my whole life. That's just crazy. So now I don't really made it. I don't know where I'll be going, where I'll be picked at. Now you go into the biggest stage of all, it's like a dream come true. It's Najee Harris. Right now we're in the backyard of the Rocket Mortgage Draft House. Y'all see what's going on? Ping pong battle, battle of the ages right now. Oh. To the left, standing at 4'9", 100 pounds, soaking wet. J-Dub. <laughs> to my right, standing at, on a given day, you know what I'm saying, 5'9", 196, if that. <laughs> we got the one and only Jamar Chase. We're playing to 11, let's get it. I think it's gonna be a good match. Dub with a nice serve. Okay, we need some That's more. Uh, oh, oh! Weight room, is, is the weight room. Weight room. Need that one point, sir, can I have it? At LSU, we actually had a ping pong table, so. Ready? I actually learned how to serve from somebody at LSU, and you gotta hit it low. Nice serve by Chase right now, hit the thing. Oh! That, that's not a rule against That's a serve. I don't know why I don't actually knew how to do that, but that was something that I learned, and I took it with me here. So we got a nice serve right now. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, I think it bounced yeah. off my stand. Yeah. Strategy was, you know, get the corners, you know, make sure he stretch out and hopefully he mess up. Yes, sir. Executing it well at this point. I don't know how I'm hitting that, that hard. <laughs> Three, two, dub up. Let's go. It's a back and forth game. They're clearly even matched. Woo! That's point. I got J-Dub one in. It's my boy. He wanted to play squared up. I'm making an attack the edge. You know what I mean? I'm going. I'm trying to close it out real early. It's your halftime interview. Yup. How are you feeling right now? Man, I'm finna come back. He got his homeboy over there. I'm just the ref. I'm finna come back. I ain't gotta say much. You know, he got some pretty good serves, so I'ma play defense, but I don't let my defense be my offense, because when he play offense, he gonna have to play defense. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, like that? Okay. Yeah. Okay, this is underway. Oh! oh. Yup. Yeah. Yeah. I started having opportunities to start doing my serve. I think that's how I came back. I ain't gonna lie, he had like this little low serve. Now I just start getting too excited and hitting it too hard. Now we're, <gasps> let's go. Now I'm feeling like I gotta win this. When it's game point, it goes to the losing person. As y'all can see, Chase made a magical comeback. Not magic. Now it's time for me to put on my ping pong skills and take off and walk. We're underway. Let's see if somebody gonna kind of speed up the process right now. Now he gets to talking to me, telling me to speed up the game. And then I try to speed up. I'm like, oh, man. And oh, let's go! <laughs> I'm listening to you, bro. Hey. Talk about speeding up, let's go. I can't even play it at my own pace. I don't know why he started doing that. I feel like him and Chase secretly had a, a, a thing going on they were trying to portray for the camera. But that's just my thoughts. Y'all saw what happened. Jamar Chase came home with the victory. You know what they call me with, with ping pong, bro? What they call you? Pocket rocker. Why they call you that? <laughs> I'm swinging it pocketly. <laughs> Jamar Chase, your winner. I'm swinging it pocketly. <laughs> I'm, I'm swinging it pocketly. So I go to nap here or not in the east. Well, hello with the Rhonda. Oh, yeah, get ready. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> My mom will usually do my hair. Get situated with my hair. I'm gonna show you the excellent way to make it look. You know, I'm not saying your mama didn't do a good job. I'm sure she did. <laughs> Put all the love in there, because that's her baby. But this is what I do for a living. She's a stylist for Marshawn, too. She does Marshawns. And hopefully she'll make you look good. Hey, who here, babe? Huh? Who, who here? Y'all got the same, actually, you got the same texture no. here. I have more curls. I'm telling you. He don't like his curly hair. He got curly hair. He don't like it. Just can't wait for this stuff just to be over so I can see where I'm setting up shop. I'm a, I, I see my dye in my hair red. What you think? Red? What team are you going to? We're going to to your team. I'm going to Raiders. Uh, you can't go with red hair. It's only going to be like three teams maximum. Do you pick or do they pick you? How does that work? They pick you. It's going to be the Cardinals, Dolphins, and Steelers. It's only gonna be those three teams, man. It's like, that might, I might go in the second round. Whatever ha what happens, happens at the end of the day. Can I answer this real quick? Hey, this is Marshawn? Yep. She was like, Sean here better than yours. I was like, nah, you ain't seen his lately. Nah, I have up. He know he ain't seen it lately. Damn, nah, boy. Oh, that was you gonna put them little <laughs> 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 And then you got your preschool. Dude, that's the starter pack trend. <laughs> ah, All right, I'm damn, sorry. Damn, damn. I'm sorry. Watch out, he a deep for two. Obviously, he talks other shit. I talk too. It's cool, though, you know what I'm saying? It's just, we're all just family. You gonna be there? 
this for you. <laughs> nah, yeah, it's, it's, it's cool. Yeah, I'm really, I mean, I'm, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to get out the way. Marshawn is saying, like, you know, whatever happens, happens for a reason. Bro, it's dope. Good luck. We want to congratulate this man. He's doing it up, yes. I right, give you love. <laughs> Emotions was a high, you know, walking through the airport. It was pretty cool, a lot of fans out there. Finally in Cleveland, uh, day before the draft. Got my family out here with me, so now I'm getting a little more excited. I was just ready to get to the hotel. <laughs> I'm really sleepy still, that's why I got my glasses on. Ooh. Put your glasses on, people don't know when your eyes closed. <laughs> oh. I just can't wait to get this over with just because it's really happening. Right now we at the location for the draft day thing, and I'm just checking out some of the stuff. I chose not to go to Cleveland because there's a lot of people who helped me. There's no way I could just pick nine people. This right here is for the kids. <laughs> and it, <laughs> this right here is, uh, is Marshawn's bike, and I think I'm about to be riding that around the block. The plan is to mainly just see my family. So I haven't seen a lot of them in years. We're gonna be sitting right here, right? So you're going to be right where the tape is. My family's going to be all right here, and everybody's going to be in the back and stuff like that. For him to be able to come under role models like Marshawn, who is Mr. Oakland, I love doing stuff like this for the boys when, you know, they're getting ready to make history. It's important there, everywhere in the Bay Area, Northern California, really. Show them a sign of, of, of hope. You know, this is a hard time for everyone right now, so we need some happiness right now. So this is a really, you know, joyous event tomorrow. If I could be any way of sign of hope, or like, you know, sign of like, you know, there, there could be something out of here, you should always play that part. When I arrived, I got all my family and everything. It's a special moment for everyone, but you know, having familiar faces there while you're going through this is definitely important. As soon as you get off the airport and stuff, it's like fans. So you definitely feel like the draft atmosphere the whole time you're there. And you know, feel like a dream. Smooth, out here with my family. It's gonna be a good day, good time. This is my first time in Cleveland. I liked it. I liked the city. I liked the scenery. The town was, you know, very like old school, but I like it. It's the evening before the draft, and I'm feeling good. Just taking it in real slow, trying to enjoy everything. But I mean, it's pretty smooth. This has been a journey. Starting off and training and doing all that good stuff. Kind of coming to an end and starting like a new journey. It's just been a long time coming. Excited to see you. Uh, like where I'd be staying for the next four years. Look, they got just filled. Look at me! Look at me! <laughs> Dog, why they do that to me? I, I'm like, man, I know I'm somewhat attractive in that. It's draft day and I'm doing some yoga stuff. That's like a zen. Half time before the mayhem begins. Time for mine. And then get the show going. Excitement, anxiety, happy. Frustrated, overwhelmed, scared, hoping everything goes planned. Is there a plan? As planned as just getting picked in the first round. The day of the draft, it was raining. I was running late because I didn't even know which way it was. A lot of fans out there. It was fun going in the rain. On the red carpet, I was with my mom and dad. Mom, dad look good, suit and tie, you know. I mean, it runs in the family. I'm excited, actually, you know. Just to be here with my family and friends, you know. Um, it's a blessing to be here, so I just can't wait to get it started. I did pick the shoes that I bought from Sykes. Did anyone ask you about the orange? Um, yeah, got orange on today for the bingos, huh? I was like, oh, 
Wow, I really haven't really paid attention that much on the shoes, but that's all I can say. <laughs> I just walked off. <laughs> I did see Jalen Waddle's fit. He was fresh. He was fresh. Oh, yeah, this is a one on one. Me and B. Williams designed this together. That's like so last minute, too. Like, I literally got it probably the day before I left to Cleveland. Got the custom Nikes on. That's how we rocking today. What kind of Nikes on those? I can't even tell you. That's how exclusive they is. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> exclusive. Oh my God. The gang is here. Keontae, too. Hello. Most people think he's the first running back taken off the board. I think today starts at 16, which is which is the Cardinals. Forget all the mock drafts, forget all the people that called you. Now it's a matter of, you know, what happens, happens. Did I, did I follow back? Probably no. not, huh? Yeah, I know. For what we've gone through and, you know, sometimes feeling like you made mistakes along the way and you didn't do things right. And he's made it despite all those obstacles. Because I'm watching my son achieve his dreams. Like, that's really special. You're talking about, where you at? Like, I'm in Oakland. Uh, it's like, oh, okay, because uh, we're going to send a G5 jet there. I'm like, what? If we pick you, I'm like, all right. After the red carpet, we went back to our seats. We was in there waiting. It was countdown. The 2021 NFL draft is now officially open. Woo! I threw a draft party back at home so they could watch and, you know, enjoy from almost a lot of people. I texted Dan and I said, I hope I don't cry. Because, you know, we all was athletes. Uh, I played baseball, played in college. His dad played football. But Jamal took it to another level. I'd be glad when it's over with. We all can settle down and enjoy his NFL play. But wherever he lands, they're going to have a good player. When we started seeing the picks go through, I think that's when we sat down and started, like, you know, let's watch for real. The Cincinnati Bengals are on the clock now. Earlier that morning, I had got a text from Joe. He said, uh, I hope your bags are packed. I know it's me at the moment. That's what I'm saying to myself. I can't wait to be a part of it. Come on, Chase! Come on, Chase, baby! What, bro? Uh, that, that lineman dude. Yeah, him or Jamar. Yeah, it's time. I think that was, you know, something that we knew was coming low key before it happened. I'm sure the entire family feels like Jamari has accomplished something that none of us have, have ever done. It was really so fast, you know, finally going up there and, and holding my jersey. I couldn't do nothing but just look at it, really recognize that this is real. Dolphins on the clock and we just chilling. I mean, like hella shit happening right now, bro. I bet they like, ooh, they just moving around everything. You know, I'm feeling like calm, um, cool, like just hanging. Really just waiting on name to be called. Miami Dolphins select Jalen Waddle. Oh, what a Let's go! Let's go! It's time! It was just excitement. No, really. There's a whole bunch of excitement. That's helping too, Al. For sure. A perfect fit. It was just, just like a surreal moment. We just can't like just bottle it up, like all type of emotions go through your head and, and things like that. It's a good ass pick, boy. Yeah, it's cool as hell. You see like all your teammates and friends getting picked, just excited for them and happy for them. I think for Pittsburgh, we want all the QBs to go and we want um, the, the two corners to go and one just win. Arizona, a little different. There's a couple defensive players that they need that are there. You got to look alive around the, the 16th pick. When it gets around your pick, they're like, all right, now you feel like the, the pressure. Did somebody train up? How the hell does the Jets? For real? It's like, oh, man. Let's see how they're going to do the running backs this year. How you feeling? I'm good. Damn, you know, the, 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 the more closer I, I get, the more nervous it is. Here's the deal. I think the Jets are going up right now to get the linebacker. That means Arizona is open because they, they wanted the defensive players, so we're still playing Arizona, okay? 
and then we want we want New England to take Mac Jones. Mac Jones got picked <laughs> to the Patriots, and then that was like, you know, I was like, yeah. I now my heart was pounding. I don't think it's uh, I don't think it's Arizona. I mean, uh, they want they're gonna. I think they go with that linebacker. Anxiety, the the, the pressure, the the overwhelm was like, oh man. And they picked a defensive player. Oh damn! How the hell Doug know that, bro? What the hell? That's so again, what, I told you they're gonna take that linebacker. Yeah. So no, so look again. We got Miami. We got Pittsburgh. What? Seventeen. The Raiders had seventeen picks. Raiders are seventeen. So we, and then and then we got Miami. Waddle, me and Tua reunited. Like that's perfect. What, what Marcus and them at? What Marcus and them? Okay. Miami's taking the pass rusher, Jalen Phillips. Miami. Yeah. Oh, they picked Jalen. KP. I feel like, oh sh. I'm like, there's a chance I'll go in the second round now. I think it's got to be Pittsburgh. <laughs> Every pick that goes by, I just feel it more and more and more. Like I said, I I, I think it's Pittsburgh, and it's coming up in a pick and a half. So deep breaths, and make sure your phone's on. This break's been dead quiet, which is good news. They've been completely radio silent the last hour. Good news? Yeah, that's good news. Oh man, I'm starting to feel some And now my phone better ring in about 12 minutes. It's gotta be pissed Still on the clock. My gut tells me it's pissed Hey! Hello? <laughs> yes, sir. Man, you know what this is. Yeah, I already know what it is. Yeah. Hey, you ready to do this, young man? Hold on. Hold on, Coach. Hold on. Hold on. Hey, appreciate it, Coach. Thank you. Thank you for everything, Coach. No, son, talk to him. I can hear it on his side. Shut up! Shut up! Hey, 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 um, right now, right now I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm just staying in the hotel in Oakland right now, downtown Oakland, at my, uh, until... Man, he hung up. They hung up on me. <laughs> they hung up the phone, bro. <laughs> yeah, I got you now. Sorry about that. Hey, they picking me right now. I don't know how y'all want to do it. First person to call me up after all that, Snoop Dogg. Snoop wants you to talk to you right now. Yo. Nephew, nephew, nephew. You already know, huh? I got you, huh? You already know that. Appreciate everything. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Run that ball. I gave a speech, just appreciate everybody, thanking everybody. We all know each other some way, in some form or fashion, you know, um, but words can't describe my feeling right now. You know, the draft and stuff happened, but you know, I'm, 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 I'm still in all these reporters and stuff. I'm, I'm more excited just seeing everybody here. I'm gonna say it was always worth it though, you know, to, for it to all come down in this one day and you know, finally feel that relief. I'm just, just blessed. Love you, bro. This is the best spot we want to do. This is huge, dude. No rush. Crazy, bro. Crazy. That's crazy, dog. This is going to be a hole in one. I'm calling it right here. <laughs> it's been a long journey. I went number one receiver. I mean, that's something you could say. You know, now I got to do it again back on the field at Cincinnati against the best of the best every day. 
This is only the beginning. Yeah, I wanna know what. I was on the wrong note. You, you was, was on right. the wrong I note? I was on the wrong note. Just growing up, I always knew I wanted to play in the NFL. Back to square one. I just wanna show them that they made a, a good investment. Really, check out prove everything. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm playing with some of these people that I used to watch since I was like eight. I don't know, I have a chip on my shoulder. I'm just gonna keep grinding, keep faith, and you know, just keep looking for ways to get better and better and better. Heading to Pittsburgh, now I gotta find a place to live. Oh my bad, I didn't even, come on, y'all just be sneaking up on me. All right, all right, all right. Just watch these videos right here, subscribe, and then we'll get back to the dancing. <laughs>